In this short video, we will discuss how much fodder to feed beef cattle and the results you can expect to see. One of the questions we get asked the most is, how much should I feed my cows and for what result? Feeding fodder to cattle dates right back to ancient times when nomadic tribes used primitive means to grow feed for their herds. Fast forward to 2006 when an Australian company built the first modern day hydroponic transportable system to combat the crippling drought conditions. This enabled farmers to keep their farms operational and profitable even in terrible drought conditions. So to answer the question, we need to look at the desired outcome. So for the purpose of this video, we will assume that weight gain is what we're looking to do. As a rule of thumb, if you were feeding a breeding herd and just wanting to maintain weight, halving these numbers will have the desired effect. So the commonly accepted rule when feeding fodder is to feed around 3% of body weight on a daily basis. This means for an animal weighing 250 kilos or 550 pounds, you would feed 7.5 kilos or 16.5 pounds. For the sake of simplicity, let's assume that the average herd size necessitated you to feed 18 kilos per day or 40 pounds. We know from previous videos that it costs approximately 6 cents per pound or 13 cents per kilo to produce fresh fodder and that's before capital costs are taken into consideration. This means in round numbers that the average cost to feed a beef cow fodder each day is $2.40. Now on top of this we recommend 1 to 2 kilos of dry feed such as hay and if available forage on the ground however consumption of any grass coverage will be greatly reduced. The theory is that the dry feed holds the fodder in the rumen longer which assists with weight gain. Another huge benefit is that your paddocks will regenerate much faster. You will also be able to run three times the herd size on the same footprint of land, which is great for the environment as we can stop cutting down trees. So what sort of results could you expect to see, you ask? Before I give you the answer, take a look at this black Angus cow, having been fed fodder for just 90 days. And yes, that is the same animal. This is a somewhat difficult question to answer as it varies from breed to breed and prevailing weather conditions. The majority of our experience is with Angus cattle or Angus derivatives such as Brangus but we have worked with many other breeds even Wagyu. That being said and having worked with hundreds of farmers, daily weight gains are typically between 1 and 2 kilos or 2.2 and 4.4 pounds. 1.5 kilos is common. The other good news is that your cattle will be classed as grass fed and you will significantly reduce methane outputs according to our recent study. We also have meat tests showing enormous lifts in certain markers in the meat, meaning it is significantly healthier for human consumption. This of course opens up a number of marketing possibilities, however we will leave this for another video. So if you want healthier, happier cattle, would like to get your herd to the market faster, producing healthier and environmentally friendly beef, fodder might be something that you take a close look at. Thanks for watching and we look forward to providing you more useful information soon.